The U.S. Air Force Concert Band and Singing Sergeants are coming to Tennessee, Arkansas, and Virginia this month. One of their stops is right here in the Volunteer <laughs> State in Johnson City. That's what we're focusing on. It's part of their community relations tour. And here with all the details is Flight Commander Captain David Regner. Welcome, David. Hi, thank you so much for having me. Well, we're glad to have you because I know this is a special treat. You said it's been a while since you performed in Johnson City. Tell me about what people can expect tonight where you'll be performing. Right, so tonight we're going to be put, performing at East Tennessee State University. Um, and what they can expect is some of your classic patriotic tunes like God Bless America, America the Beautiful, uh, but they can also expect everything from Sousa to Broadway and even movie music. Ooh, okay. We have to read okay. something for everyone to really enjoy tonight. That's what I love. All right, get the groove on a little bit as well <laughs> as a little bit of patriotism. Now, you're the flight commander and you told us during the break that that's a fancy way of saying conductor. What are we dealing with here when we talk about a concert band and singing sergeants? Right, so the concert band is made up of, you know, your classic brass instruments, woodwind instruments, percussion, but the singing sergeants who are some of the best voices that you're going to hear, uh, you know, soprano, alto, tenor, bass. And so this unit that we have here is really responsible for doing three things. That's we want to honor our veterans tonight. We want to inspire our audiences to a heightened sense of patriotism. And we really want to just connect to the American public in a much broader way to make them feel that they're part of the Air Force family. And we do have a very heavy veteran population. And if you're not a veteran in this area, we know you support veterans. So people want to come out to this. The best part about it, it's free. 100%. I mean, how is that even possible? Well, it's because, you know, everyone who's pay, playing, paying their taxes has already paid for this. Um, but really, it's, we're just such so overjoyed to be sharing this wonderful concert with this beautiful community. Oh, I'm looking forward to it. And we love a free concert, so you might as well just head out and go. I mean, the Martin Center is a beautiful venue. Absolutely it is. But I did want to ask about the history of this band. You know, maybe people don't know the Air Force has a long history with bands and, and musical performance. So tell us a little bit about where the Air Force gets uh, gets these bands from. Right. The, the, the history of the Air Force band is a little bit unique because we actually predate the founding of the Air Force. So we were founded in 1941, right before we entered World War II. Uh, and since then, we've actually performed for him, for every single president since Truman. Oh. Yeah, it's, um, and then. It's a lot of presidents. <laughs> it's a lot of presidents. Um, but we've expanded also, you know, uh, as we evolve, we want to reach more uh, different audiences and newer audiences. So we've expanded from the concert band to include things like a string orchestra, Orchestra, a jazz band, even a rock band. And also the ceremonial brass that we have currently in Washington, D.C., they're responsible for over 800 ceremonies conducted at Arlington National Cemetery every single year. So this is a deep-rooted history, something people can just experience here in the region without making that trip over to D.C. You mentioned you kind of have a little bit of everything for everyone. Is this family-friendly, like age range, anyone can come? Absolutely. So, for example, have you have hopefully people have seen the, the great movie, The Greatest Showman. Yes. We're featuring music from that. And it's really oh, sold. It's one of my favorite movies <laughs> and it's been such a joy for us to see how audiences react to that particular music it's been so exciting to perform for it that's going to be hard because those songs make me want to dance in the aisle is there going to be room to get <laughs> up gonna and be dance room for that and for you know whenever we play the uh one of the other things that we have room for when we play the salute to the armed forces when uh, we play each of the service songs there's room for the marines to do push-ups also oh okay <laughs> that's not what i typically think of when i am listening to music so i will leave that to you guys sure. i'm going to keep doing the dancing <laughs> david thank you so much we're looking forward to the performance and the u.s air force concert band and singing sergeants will be at the martin center for the arts at ETSU this evening at 7.30. It's a free event, so come out and enjoy some live music. More details on our website. We will be right back.